My friends be in your friends bonnet, life. Potter. Ah, a sorting hat in training. Well, why don't you give it a go, young man? Yes, yes, a thirst to prove yourself. No, that's not what you... That's not how you do it. You can't pick two houses, you little shit. I'm putting you in Slytherin. I'm trying to put her to bed, but she won't sleep. What? Oh, great heavens! <laughs> Jinx, it's okay. It's just a nightmare. Jinx! Jinx, wake up! Jinx! Do you think Silco is a good father? Because a father figure is something you would hold up as a model. You wouldn't hold Silco up as a model. That's not, not the complete man. But do I think he was a good father? Well, we have to look at the list. I mean, when Jinx needed him the most, he tried to guide her. He was calm and not angry at a moment when she messed something up, except for when she killed all those enforcers and he lost his mind. But most of the time, he was pretty even-handed, right? That's a good thing. He just wanted ultimately for her to be her authentic self, what he saw in her to be powerful, you know, to be the woman that she was a child of Zahn. And that's what Zahn is. And to help it come about as a nation, which is what a role to give to your, your child to say like, you know, I think you have it in you to do this. Like, I think you have it in you to build these incredible tools. I think I do. And to give them purpose and to be behind them. Not perfect. I think Silco by far was not perfect. There were times when it was like, oh, he said that, oh, he did that. But I mean, by the end, when he says to her, don't cry, you're perfect. In a way, he's happy to die and step to the side so she can be the one that brings the bombs on. What greater sacrifice can you give as a parent than to let your kid be who they are and step out of the way? See you guys. Happy Christmas to all of my fans and everyone who has watched Arcane and been moved by its incredible power. Thank you to all the simps, to all the fan artists, to everyone who's made this fandom complete. May you have a wonderful holiday with friends and a joyous new year. Cheers. It's okay. We'll show you. We will show them all. You're strong now, just like you were always meant to be. Jinx is perfect. Here, let me give you a hand. Jinx! 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 Stop the music. I never would have given you to them. Not for anything. Don't cry. You're perfect. You're a class act, sister. Is there anything sister, it thought I missed as her. a doing? I would have missed her. As a daughter. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going to abandon you again. Holy shit. So I don't know how many of you watch Arcane or have watched it or any of it and loved it as much as I did. Probably my favorite TV show I've ever watched now. Probably a favorite of all time. Um, also, don't know if any of you are aware that the voice actor of Soko, Jason Spisak, Spisak, I have it's no idea how to pronounce his last name, but is on TikTok and the man knows the power he wields. 
Yes, I know. He knows. He knows. He's seen all of you. Oh, yes, I have. It's amazing. Betrayal. That pain that you feel could eat you up from the inside out. Can either break you or forge you into something greater. You are strong now, just like you were always meant to be. To all of my simps, this is Silco. Don't cry. You're perfect. This is a special song for all of my Silco fans who were sad after the last episode of Arcane. Hey, Holbo man, hey, Dapper Dan. We've both got our style, but brother, you're never fully dressed without a smile. Your clothes may be Brummelly, and they stand out a mile, but brother, you're never fully dressed without a smile. Who cares what they're wearing on Piltover Savile Row? It's what you wear from ear to ear, and not from head to toe that matters. So in for Sir Soul Janitor, so long for a while, remember you're never fully dressed. Though you may think you look your best, you are never fully dressed without a smile. Smile, Daniel. Well, TikTok, this is Silco, and I see all of the things you're doing, and I love it. Power, real power, it doesn't come to those who were born fastest or strongest. No, it comes to those who will do anything to achieve.